checking out books from the school library. That's usually something that everyone's able to do. Well, over at SciFair ISD, now parents will require permission. That's right. This is all coming after the Board of Trustees voted to allow families to block their kids from the library if that's what they want to do. Fox 26's Natalie He reporting from SciFair. Dear parents and guardians, all CFISD students may check out books from their campus library. If you do not want your student to check out books from the campus library, you may opt out of this access by visiting the parent portal. This was the voice message parents at SciFair ISD received this week after the Board of Trustees voted unanimously last week to allow parents to ban their kids from having library access. Parents can also filter what level of books their kids can check out. I, of course, choose not to because I want my children to learn. Ali Fitzpatrick is a parent to two incoming third graders at SciFair ISD. She strongly opposes censoring kids' access to books. I think SciFair made a mistake by allowing this policy to come into our district. I think it opens the door for a lot of very myopic views that a certain minority group in this area are pushing. It seems that they're really afraid of um, any books that mention anything about being transgender, exploring your sexuality, being gay. If gay children never read a book, where that type of relationship is discussed, they are at a much higher risk for suicide, depression, self-harm. It's um, a preemptive move because the Texas legislature may um, address this in their future session. Diana Alexander is an educator in the district. She says the policy puts extra pressure on teachers and librarians who must now sort through book inventory and determine which level the books fall under. So there's just a lot of different stressors on teachers right now, and we don't need to add on to them. This has always been an option for parents, for parents to say, I do not want my child to read this book. They have always had that ability. Well, the policy is set to go into effect on November 15th. That will allow educators more time to sort out the book categories.